Deep in Carmarthenshire's rolling hills, little has changed in centuries. But land, once farmed here by families, is moving into new hands. Not to locals, but to multi-billion pound investment firms. Those fields, you know, that's generations of hard work. To see it destroyed just for an investment company to be able to plant trees, to me, is... is, is uh, it's just incredibly upsetting. In the tiny village of Corty Cadno lies Frongok Farm. It was recently bought by London-based investment company Foresight Group, which has plans to plant thousands of trees here. But locals fear swathes of conifers could damage the very landscape. Trees are a good thing and we want to promote tree growth. What we're looking at is the wrong trees for ecological and environmental purposes. Not only does it affect the visual and the spatial enjoyment of this beautiful area, but it really has an impact on everybody who lives here. Mass tree planting is not just an issue at Frong Gok. It's understood around a dozen farms in Wales have been snapped up by companies outside of the country. It is easy to see the attraction for outside investors. Firstly, simply owning the land is obviously a significant asset. Secondly, they can make money from timber grown here. And thirdly, they can sell carbon credits from the trees they plant to any company that wants to offset its carbon footprint. The Welsh government wants to plant 86 million trees by the end of this decade, with substantial grants available. But it does admit it is keen to avoid outside interests buying up Welsh land. Foresight Group told Sky News its plans for new woodlands are an activity which is recognised by the Welsh Government as an important part of the twin fights against climate change and biodiversity loss. It added, we will be planting a diverse species mix at Frongok. Foresight never plants trees on land that can support productive commercial food crop growth. The National Farmers Union in Wales welcomes tree planting schemes, but says they should complement farming, not replace it. If you've seen a monoculture approach to this and a blanket of forestation, that's a fundamental change. That's not what we're looking for here in Wales. A fundamental change in what way to a community? Well, to a, well, it's decimation of that community, really, isn't it? This aspect of the valley will be obliterated. Community concern comes amid big climate change targets. Changing the landscape could be the price to pay in order to meet them. Dan Whitehead, Sky News in Corticadno, Carmarthenshire.